course. But 42% of people play the piano. I thought that it, it might also be cool to do chess. But... Yeah. November 5th, 2038. Oh, we fucking love sports here in Detroit. Uh, back with Connor. RK800. No dogs or androids. Damn, dude. It's rough out here. It's rough, rough. Man, it's... Did you come like in a here he's a friggin' android? What the hell? Rough, rough. Fine, Lieutenant. Yeah, I do. I got it. I, 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 it's, it's a rough, rough life. It's funny. Hmm. Dempsey Edward. That guy looks like Shelby. <laughs> this is exactly what Norman Line said. This is my favorite part. Jimmy Peterson. Oh, he's a business owner. Nice. No he was born in 2001. Oh, God. Security guard. Buy me a drink? I think it's probably the guy playing the game. Lieutenant? Johan Kim. Yeah, it's definitely the guy playing the game. Nope, never mind. Sam McCray. My other thought was it was this guy. Nope. Okay, I'm trying to. This guy? Oh my god. Hank Anderson, it's that guy. How long has it been? Dennis Ward. The fuck you looking at? Yeah, this is, this, these guys are going to get What up, man? Just going to scan your face real fast. Chris Roberts. Okay. Does anybody have a... I mean, the one guy's a DOI, but everything else, everyone else seems pretty clean. Lieutenant Anderson. My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. Get out of here. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. Just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Um... So Norn Lion was like a dick to him. I feel like you kind of have to be a dick to him. I was going to say, oh, understanding. Or, uh, I mean, it's either reason or persist because he's not going to take understanding well. My opinion. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. Fuck. Mm. Buy the guy a drink. I guess maybe understanding. I just if we're I understand gonna try to not to persist. Not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. Yeah, buy him a drink. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender? The same again, please. See that gym wonders of technology. Make it a double. Hey, no like... lion spilled his drink out. Jesus. <sighs> Did you say homicide? Does not compute. Does he want me to repeat myself? Homicide? Mm, error. You wait here. 
what has it been like a year since last time? Hmm. Probably diplomatic. Yeah. My instructions are to accompany you to the crime scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. I told you to wait here. So you shut the fuck up and you wait here. Yeah, follow him anyways. See, now you've given him a chance. And if he's going to continue to be a dick, that's when you become firm. I'm not confirming anything. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. Told you, Steve. stay in the car, didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We were starting to think you weren't gonna show. Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We have a call around eight from the land. Lord, the lieutenant hadn't paid his rent for a few months, so he thought he'd drop by, see what was going on. Those old people fucking walk too slow. When he found the body. even worse before we opened the windows. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Explains why he's been here for a while. Most of the time, they hardly ever saw him. Wow, well, stayed easy in. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break-in? Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. Well, I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. Hmm, he liked MMA. Is there anything near you over here? Each letter is perfect. It's way too neat. No human hmm. rights. Red eyes. I have a feeling there's going to be a continuing issue with red eyes in this game. Specifically. That particular drug. Chris, is this written in the victim's blood? I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. It's such a weird way to sample stuff. Oh, Jesus, what the hell are you doing? I'm analyzing the blood. I can check samples in real time. I'm sorry. I should have warned you. Okay, just don't put any more evidence in your mouth. You got it? Got it. <sighs> Fucking hell, I can't believe this shit. Oh, it's his. Assembled it in 19 days. Three weeks to do it. Analyze. No fingerprints, Android involvement. Pretty open and shut case as far as what happened. He was probably uh, taking red ice and um, became combative. Was abusive to his android. His android was like, "Fuck this!" Killed I'm him. Howdy. Yeah, he, yeah, yeah. He, he broke.
I like how because the crime scene is older, it's a little bit harder to put it together. You have to do it kind of step by step. Yeah. Came from the kitchen. Jesus. He was stabbed 28 times. Yeah. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Red ice. Seems our friend Carlos liked to party. Haunt Cyberlife Sands. Wow. There you go. That's how you know it was done by a fucking android. First, I want full analysis on the narcotics. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Yeah, there's a possi- No, never mind. I was going to say there's a possibility the android might still be close by. And the only reason why I would say that is hey, Mike, where does an android go? If they don't know where to go? Yeah. I guess they become homeless. Yeah, that's it. You're going to want to remember these events. Thanks, Corn. I'm using this game is pretty good. Yeah. I'd like to see parts where he re recreates a crime scene and then finds other evidence and then the crime scene re recreation changes. Gossip bully. Android sex officially better. Sorry, ladies, but plastic can't be beat. The result of our survey is in, and it's official. 68% of men prefer sex with an android to a real woman. And with 52% of men saying they've tried the experience at least once, that's a lot of android love to go around. There are a few reasons given for this preference, but we think we know the real reason. Androids don't want to talk about their feelings afterwards. This, this story was sponsored by Eden Club. Discretion is our middle name. Is your android spying on you? Cyberlife could be using its androids to collect private information. More and more experts are suggesting that Cyberlife uses its 120 million androids to record details of private conversations of its customers and sell them to trading partners. Ever talked about buying the, that new car while eating dinner with your partner? Cyberlife could use that information for targeted advertising. The information goldmine doesn't stop there. Everything from personal indiscretions to political affiliations could easily be extracted and potentially used for nefarious purposes. Oh my god, it's like Facebook. The spate of reports linking Warren's presidency to Cyberlife only even such concerns. Several consumer rights organizations have requested that Cyberlife disclose the information it gathers and who it sells that information to, but the company has always refused. Requests for a formal inquiry have been gone unanswered so far. So that means it's like definitely happening. All right, Mr. Photographer, I need to look at this empty space for a knife. Not much of a view. Hmm. Fingerprints from Carlos Ortiz. Traces of Ethereum. So he hit. Hmm. See, that's what happened. He became aggressive and was beating on the android. Android sex. Hmm. If I didn't have a partner, I would probably try androids. If I had a partner, I would not. I don't know why I'm saying partner like I go both ways. A woman. Um. Uh, yeah. And I... If, if I were to try that, it would probably be some specific like android sex worker thing i don't think i would ever try android sex with my live-in android <laughs> i think that would get a little weird but i wonder if some people are creating like actual relationships with androids yeah i don't know corn would you uh 
Uh, would you partake? Would you partake in android sex? This is a strange question. <laughs> Religious offering? Hmm. But what religion? RA9. So I definitely think it's linked to the red ice. What is what is that just blood? I think it was the blood on the wall. Mm. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what if I got no bitch, then oh, hell yeah. yeah. Shoot. I'm, I'm with all you. Ears. It all started in the kitchen. In the kitchen. In the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is. What exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android with a bat. With the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. I play Clue. The android stabbed the victim. Oh, wait. Okay. Yeah, the android stabbed the victim. Yeah, he stabbed the victim first before throwing the chair, right? The chair wasn't even thrown. It was no, knocked it over. No, it was knocked over. Yeah. The android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to... The living room. The living room. sense the android murdered the victim with, with the, the bat knife. <laughs> with the knife <laughs> i kind of like to replay this and do okay. a bunch of like wrong shit just to see what happens your theory's not totally ridiculous but it doesn't tell us where the android went it was damaged by the bat and lost some therium lost some what therium you call it blue blood it's the fluid that powers Android's biocomponents. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh, but I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. Uh, it's, oh, near the door. Wait, wait, is that a door in here? Yeah, it's on, on the other side of that wall. The right? Look behind you. I mean, this is where the struggle was. Obviously, there's oh, yeah. going to be... I was talking about the, the yellow things. Okay. All my training is for nothing. So you you can check the window, but I'm assuming this way is probably more appropriate. No, oh, look up. He's still inside the fucking house. What did I fucking say? He 
grab a chair. What is that other thing to... Oh, I guess it'll... I guess you've eliminated that option. Well, no, I think it has an open chest. Hey, 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 what are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. statue. God. I was just defending myself. This Finn is gonna kill me. In Star I'm Wars. <laughs> Don't tell him. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant! Oh, they don't give you a choice. Oh shit. Chris! Finn! I guess that's in line with Connor's programming. Come on! He hasn't quite become human. Okay, let's see where we stand with other people. So far, so good. So it seems like a lot of people took the same path. It just, Apparently there's a way you don't find the... Well, by fucking up the uh, evidence, I guess. Yeah. But, like, how could you mess that up? If you pick the wrong stuff, I guess. In the, uh... Well, okay, so that, that happens at check shower. Hmm. So... And then that happens at examining statue. There must have been something else I could have examined in there. Yeah. Well, uh, you remember there was a yellow thing above the window. Oh, in the bathroom? No, in in, in the oh, kitchen. Oh, I did that in the kitchen. Well, because he did the door, and then he did the the thing. I know, but I walked over there, and it didn't work. And yeah. Well, that's what I'm saying. Because I wonder if maybe you could have checked that before, and that might have opened up another option. I don't yeah. know. Getty. And my least favorite way to ever like provide to it. Eat spaghetti. Wasn't much in the yeah. I, did what I, could. I can't stand people who just fucking make this noodles and then put the sauce on top of the noodles. The hell is that? Put some effort into it. Yeah, mix, mix the shit. And mix the sauce into the noodles before you serve it. Life's funny. 
I lost my job because of androids. And I need somebody to take care of this goddamn house. I think you'll take umbrage with the fact that you would serve her first or some shit. Androids are so fucking wonderful. They never fail. They're never tired. They're never sad. They're so fucking perfect. They ruined my fucking life. What are you looking at? What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off. You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking accountant! It's all your fault. Daddy, no! It's all your fucking fault! Get back here. Come back I'm here. I'm not finished with you. Come back here right now! Fast enough, man. I have power. Check Dallas. Okay. You can't reason with Todd. I think there is a way you can reason with Todd. Okay, so if he knows that you've moved and you're putting yourself in his way, he's going to react poorly. Yeah, I know, but... You want to... Oh, my. They don't... Oh, oh, fucking my. I'm assuming Protect Alice is the upper one. Or is Reasoning with Todd the upper one? Successfully. Oh, there's multiple ones. You can, you can jump straight to the end one right there. Or you can go down here. Yeah, fuck it, Reasoning with Todd, I guess. Yeah. Calm, determined, or understanding? Determined would mean that you would be uh, uh, confronting him in some way. Mm -hmm. um, calm is probably not something he wants to... I, I say understanding. Yeah. Todd, please, I know you're angry, but... You stay out of this, or you'll be next. <laughs> Alice! Daddy's very mad! Okay, so I know we can grab the gun, but do we want to grab the gun? Pause it. Northern line, grab the gun. I don't know. Okay, so based on previous stuff, I don't know that there's a way you can stop him without the gun because of your 
build quality. But then again, when he beat you up last time, you weren't you probably weren't deviant. Yeah. If we don't grab the gun now, we won't have a chance to grab it later, right? Yeah. There's also the escape from the room. And the fact that it noticed the escape from the room from her room means that if you kill him, you'll probably escape immediately out that window. No. Not necessarily? Yeah. Maybe that's where the girl would go. I guess in the interest of doing something different, I'm assuming grabbing that gun is like an almost an insta win in some way, it's depending not. on how you use it. I would say don't grab the gun. Unless you want to grab the gun. I don't know. I mean, let's not grab the gun. Let's not see what happens. Okay. You're on good. That's enough. Leave her alone. What the fuck are you doing? Get out of here. That's an order. You hear me? No. I want you to leave Alice alone. You want? What do you mean you want? You don't want anything. You're just a goddamn piece of plastic. I think you got a problem. We need to fix that. Watch out, Kara! Ow! Fuck! <laughs> His hand on the desk. No, oh, I hate this. <laughs> what? Are you supposed to be smashing Oh, up? smashing him. Oh, I fucked this up miserably. Oh no, the girl's gonna get out, but you might not. Okay. Come back here! I can say that's success. Yeah, right. Yeah, I heard it. Pinched it on the desk. So Nordline killed him. Ultra Instinct, Matt. <laughs> some of the buttons aren't super clear on what you're supposed to be doing, and then some of them I fucked up. Yeah. That can't be a, a standard series of events. Oh. Hey, we got something new. Because we failed to open the door. <laughs> I 
I wonder how that's going to change later on if you don't grab the gun. We didn't commit homicide. Yeah. 